hello welcome back to another recipe today i'll be sharing with you how i made this jomelicious wache or awache off camera i cooked the beans halfway through so i am adding salt i'll go ahead and add the rice if I had washed the rice, I would have let it sit in the colander for all the water to be drained before adding it to the beans. I'll tell you why in the course of the video. The ratio of beans to rice depends on one's taste and preference. For me, I always use my eye and experience as the scale. I will then stir for the two to marry each other well well and follow it up with the communion wine. Yeah, we are here to make a union between the rice and the beans. Note that this is the only water I will be using in cooking this awache. Yes, and that is why I said I would have, if I had washed the rice, I would have let it sit in the colander for all the water to be drained. For me and most Ghanaians, awache cannot be complete without gari. So I have in the bowl gari, I am adding a little salt, yes, a pinch of salt. You know me and gari, mm -hmm. we are paddies. So I had to taste it and trust me, mm -hmm. gari no with the salt, it's a whole vibe. Mm -hmm. Afterwards, I'm going to add uh, some of the oil from the awache stew I made earlier on. Then I will follow it up with water. Now, I makata so for it to relax and chill. Akwaba to you if you are my OG or a new member of the family. If you are seeing my video for the first time, I am versatile nana please subscribe if you like my content if you don't like them my dear do not bother to subscribe okay i am fine you come in as and when you want to who makes a watch without talia so in my cooking pot on fire i have water with salt and i just added oil so i'll break into the water taliano mm -hmm. you may call it spark but for me and my country women hmm, taliano is the sweetest so talia sounds sweeter than spaghetti so if you want to call it spaghetti you are free to go but for me it's talia i will cover and let it cook until it is soft and tender the oil in the stew is too much, so I will scoop off the excess. As you can see, the rice is quadrupling in size. Yeah, it too broke, so me cry Jamie So later on, I asked my mom why it happens so, and she said that if the grains are old, they call for more water. And truly, I've had this rice since December. It was given to me during the Christmas break. So we are in July. So for seven months, I've had it home. I do not know the number of months it had. It stayed in the shop before it got to me. So when you are cooking your rice, you have to know your rice. And I am glad that I had more of the water to cook with. You may be wondering, what is nana doing with this quantity of her watching <laughs> it was visiting okay. day a visiting day yeah, in a never. secondary school so i wanted to surprise one of nature's cousin to me yeah it it ended up as a feast so i gave him eight packs and then i gave some to i i i i Give the rest to people and I am glad I did because they appreciated it and are even calling for more as I speak with you. 
trust me if i had left the rest in the fridge it would have gone bad because i'm not a rice person i remember once i made our chill home and then we used to live with one girl called abba she was our help she told nature and the brother that i and to be my also jay jumo near konwa awache ton that should tell you say my watch it my watch it you one of these days i will cook i watch it and invite you wherever you are who are nigeria who are germany who are asia i will invite you here now i'll be testing my watch it now i want my home at dance here on this note i want to say thank you so much for watching from the beginning up to this time until I come your way with another video, my dear, keep hope alive. Bye-bye.